vibration. Oh, and I'm sorry. I'm here at Milan Park in Fort Walton Beach on Okaloosa Island. It's right behind the Emerald Coast Convention Center. If you'd like to take a look around. Okay, now that that's done and I'm getting nice saltwater hair. One of my friends asked me to do a video on how to raise your vibrations. And one way to raise your vibrations is go to a park. Go to a river, the ocean, a public park, a nature trail, anywhere to be in touch with the elements in their natural state. If you like the water, go swimming. And I know some of us are like, well, I'm completely broke. I don't have the money to go and do. You don't necessarily have to have money. In my area, there are some places that host free movie nights. And this, it can be a dollar movie night or just a free movie night. Your public library may have some interesting events going on. My library hosts craft shows. shelters. I love going to visit the cat shelter in my area because they get to pet them and uh, you know they, they need the affection and the socialization so they don't mind to come in there and snuggle with the cat. You know anything you can think of. Some healthy raw vegetables to get it, get V8 or tomato juice, canned vegetables, It makes me happy and I don't do it all the time so moderation if you don't do anything in excess it's fine but if you want to have a chocolate cupcake and you don't gorge on them and eat them every day it's fine base foods with a lot of unhealthy fats and sugars if you eat them a lot can make you feel worse and lower your vibration so you do want to stay and eat as much healthy food natural and fresh as you can if not can frozen is fine take care of yourself Clean yourself every day, brush your teeth every day, and you're probably thinking, why are you telling me this? Some people don't. You need to take care of your body as far as cleanliness goes. Even if you're disabled, if it's nothing but a hot sponge bath, being clean helps us feel better. Um, find a dollar store spray on for it to smell good every now and again. Salt scrubs or whatever. Google stuff. I'm depressed. What can I do? Music is a huge thing in my life. I'm, I like pop music and upbeat stuff. And when I'm in a crappy mood, I put on that or watch cat videos on YouTube. Um, my videos, some people say my videos help and that's awesome because that's what I'm aiming to do is to help you improve your life in any way possible. Uh, meditation music. Look up meditation music on YouTube. YouTube and Google's free. If you don't have internet at home, 
You can go to your public library and take headphones and just sit there and meditate in the library. Nobody cares what you're doing. They're not looking. As long as you're not looking at porn or anything like that, then they don't really care. Music, being in your environment, getting don't 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 stay indoors. Awesome, and you feel the same way about them. Then they don't need to be in your life. I don't care if it's family. I don't care if it's some your lover. It's time to reevaluate and break up if you're catching what I'm saying. You know, take stock in your life. What makes you feel bad or brings you down? And if you can pinpoint it, cut it out. And some people are like, oh, it's easier said than done. Yeah, I know it's hard because you form ties and then you have the Stockholm Syndrome going on or whatever you want to call it. And you're like, oh, but I won't be able to support myself. And there's a thousand excuses, but not one good reason. If you're catch, if you know, you know what I mean? Yeah, it's hard. But think of a way to get out of that situation is if it's bringing you down and it makes you feel bad and it is not positive and it's not helping you grow or influence yourself, it needs to go. Just just like that. Oh, you don't know what it's like. I hear that a lot. Well, yes, I do. I've been in many situations similar to what you're doing and what you're going through. So, yeah, I do understand. And I can say that from experience. But take time, and sometimes if you are very busy and you're around people a lot and you travel a lot, the opposite is said for you. You need to be alone and listen to music, meditation, or just breathing, or like I said, find a park, find an ocean, find a body of water. If you have a place you can have a nice fire to meditate on, if not a candle, and have downtime. Our downtime is important, but not in excess, just like junk food. It's, it's good to feed you a little bit, but not excessively. If you're alone too much, that can make you depressed. If you're surrounded by people and things and noise all the time, that can be overwhelming and drain you. So find a happy medium. Anything you do needs balance. If you're angry all the time, why are you angry? Find out why. If it's not people and things around you, what is going on within you that needs to be healed? Look at your situation and your mental health Counseling or therapy. There's a stigma that you're crazy or something. Counseling or therapy, and that's not true. Every human being, and even animals, needs the support they need. And it's okay to be Any ideas on The friend that asked me to do this video on how to raise your vibration, I was in a really stinky mood for a couple of days, and she's just like, talk to me, what's going on? And I'm like, I just, you know, I don't want to talk to me, I just don't feel good, and I'm mad, and the whole world sucks, and whatever, and it's because I was spending too much time alone, and I was staying inside in my own environment, and it, it made me feel bad. So I'm out of that now, I have those moments occasionally, most people do. But, and you know, oh, I'm broken, and my life sucks, and, and then I take a step back, and I'm like, my life is pretty awesome, if you, if you think about it. Many people would just give anything to be in my position. I have a very peaceful place that I'm not bothered. I can do what basically whatever I want within limits. No, I don't have money to go and do and see and all that stuff, and I'm a doer. So that, that gets me down, but I have a very peaceful life. And I've cut out all the negative people and influences, so I'm not highly demanded to do anything. I'm not really in a stressful situation. I have a teenager living with me that I want to choke out, but that's just the way it is. That's life, right? It's up to you to make you feel good. I'm thinking of you. I care about you. I'm on Facebook. I've got a group there called Ask Just See Jean. Check me out on groups. 
I'm on Instagram at Jeans Pet Rock and I'm on Twitter at Jeans Pet Rock. Find me, follow me, like me, comment, whatever. And I'm glad you stopped by. I hope you're doing awesome and I hope this helped you out. And until next time, bye.